Welcome to RNH Academy channel. Today we will learn how to factorize or find the factors of a given cubic polynomial. Follow the steps. Step 1 is to find the factors of constant. Constant in the given polynomial is 2. So find the factors of 2. 1 multiply 2 is equal to 2. Minus 1 multiply minus 2 is positive 2. So factors of 2 are plus minus 1 and plus minus 2. This is a step 1. Step 2 is to find that value of x for which given cubic polynomial becomes 0. It put x equal to 1 which is a factor of 2. One whole cube minus 2 multiplied by 1 square minus 1 plus 2. Minus 1 whole cube is 1. Minus 2 multiplied by 1 square is minus 2 minus 1 plus 2 which is equal to 0. So x equal to 1 or x minus 1 is a factor of given cubic polynomial. To find remaining factors divide px by x minus 1. Divide x cube by x, which is equal to x square. Multiply x square by divide. Change the sign. x cube minus x cube is 0. Minus 2x square plus x square is minus x square. Write the remaining terms. Again, divide minus x square by x, which is equal to minus x. Multiply minus x with divisor. Minus x multiply x is minus x square. Minus x multiply minus 1 is plus x. So change the sign. Minus minus is plus. And minus plus is minus. So minus x square plus x square is 0. Minus x minus x is minus 2x plus 2. Again, divide minus 2x by x. It is equal to minus 2. Multiply minus 2 by, multiply minus 2 with divisor. Which is equal to minus 2x plus 2. Change the sign. Minus of minus is plus and minus plus is minus. So minus 2x plus 2x is 0. Plus 2 minus 2 is 0. So x square minus x minus 2 is also a factor of px. Fourth step is to use splitting the middle term method to find the factors of question. Remember, splitting the middle term method, multiply coefficient of x square and constant. Do not consider the sign. Find the factors of constant. Arrange them in such a manner to get coefficient of x. So plus 1 minus 2 is equal to minus 1. 
So x square plus x minus 2x minus 2 is equal to 0 where the first two and the last two terms. x is common in x square and x. So take it out. Remaining terms are x plus 1. Minus 2 is common in minus 2x and minus 2. So remaining terms are x plus 1 which is equal to 0. Now x plus 1 is common. Remaining terms are x minus 2 which is equal to 0. So there are three factors of cubic polynomial. First is x minus 1. Second is x plus 1. Third is x minus 2. So this brings us to an end of question 5. If you are facing problem in splitting the middle term method or long division method, watch my previous videos. See you in the next video.